down. Step back under. Stay with it. Stay with it. Diana qualified for what's called the National Judges Cup. It's an invitational meet that's sponsored by the judges organizations from each of the states throughout USA Gymnastics. She's experienced a great deal of success with medals and championships and everything else, but we really focus on the way that she has progressed herself, the way that she has moved along herself, and Diana is one of the, one of the most accomplished athletes that we have that really truly focuses, doesn't look at the scoreboard, she can tell you how she did at the end of the day. She probably couldn't tell you how she finished at the end of the day in relation to a lot of the other kids. I don't, even a lot of times she knows what she gets the scores because she is very, very intent on improving herself, using her felt, herself as a measuring stick as opposed to just trying to beat the next kid. You know, she is the, she is the tortoise as opposed to the hare. Um, I think she'll do really well. She's worked really hard and because of the way she's trained, um, she's very prepared. Um, she's really confident when she works and confident when she competes. So I think um, with all the training she's had and the experience she had, that she'll do really well. Um, she's extremely powerful, so that's why she's so great on floor. But um, balance beam, she's very brave and she's very confident, and it shows. You know, they're up there on four inches, and it can be scary, but when you watch her up there, you would never know. I'm pretty confident in her. I don't want to make her nervous. <laughs> Little bit. She's doing all those back flips and things. Maybe that makes me a little bit nervous, but I'm used to it. So, right? Mm -hmm. She's done well over the years. She has a room full of trophies and medals and take up her whole room. Her sister goes to all her competitions and she teaches her sister Jim a little bit and her sister teaches her dance. Um, bars I'm getting better at. Vault is easy and beam, uh, it's okay. I can make stuff, but it makes me nervous sometimes. You're gonna do five front tuck, front tucks. Actually, you can do that last. You're gonna do the same thing as her. Okay. Alyssa, you're going to do the same exact thing we did on tumble track the other day. The alternating between the pike and layout, and then we'll bring some back. I think that if she sets her mind to it, she can do whatever she likes. <laughs> if she continued to treat the people around her the way she does, I really think the sky's the limit for her. <laughs>